Alright guys, ADHD here, back with another video. I hope you guys are having an amazing day. I actually got a little fog on the camera there on that back, sorry about that. So today guys, it's gonna be a very, very interesting day because I bought some crap. You ready, you ready for some crap? I'm always ready for some crap. <laughs> We're always ready for some crap. That's not a good thing. I ordered some more stuff, guys. You guys have this in the last video. Put a link down below. I ordered some of the worst reviewed weapons on all of Amazon. You guys loved it. So hit the like button for this series, guys. Make sure if you haven't hit the like button, you got three seconds. Three, two, one. Just hit the like button. Good. Hopefully you did. Thanks for your boy. I love you guys. Please. Thank you. So we're going to be doing that today. Again, I ordered some of the worst reviewed stuff on Amazon, guys. And it's not that hard to find this stuff. There's some bad stuff on Amazon. I had 20 items, 20 items in my car. That all were just like, God, that can't be good. If you guys want to see more of these, let me know. I'll, I'll make sure I make it happen, guys. Hit the like button. But anyway, let's get started. Let's just, uh, I guess I'll dive, dive dead first into. Alright guys, so for the first weapon, basically I ordered this. It was a flashlight, but it's made for security guards. So, you guys know security guards, they have these really big, hefty flashlights. They can also be used for some, like, you know, some pretty hard hits. But, you know, that don't make any security guards don't get guns. But, <laughs> or tasers, or like anything cool besides a badge that, for them all. But, anyway, let's just leave security guards alone today. They just, they just really kind of tick me off some of them. But, we're gonna save our, my reservations for security guards for another day. But, basically guys, it's a flashlight that's supposed to be a bat, like a full bat that also has a flashlight in it. It's in here right now. I am very curious to find out if it works, how good it actually is. Let's find out. And I'll put the picture on screen of the bat, guys, so you guys, because I will, I wish we would have done this in the last video, too, so you guys can also see what they, I'm comparing it to, because they put these pictures of something great, and then you get it, and it's not. Everything was not what it looked like in the pictures. Are you ready? I, I think so. <laughs> I hope they didn't put a lot of packaging in there, though, because I can feel it moving around. Is it cool? No, no, it's not. Okay. <laughs> oh, well, I was expecting like five more feet. <laughs> <laughs> Who ordered a toothpick? What is this? Uh, you know those novelty Dodger bats you get? <laughs> like, that's what that looks like. That is, like the ones you get at the baseball game for free <laughs> almost, like five bucks. These are ridiculous. These are the foam things over the basketball game. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> what is this? Okay, guys, so this is the flashlight bat. Show Where's the rest of you? Where's the rest of your existence? <laughs> Do you have like a mushroom I need to hit you with? Like, <laughs> for lipo, after lipo. What the <laughs> hell? Okay, look over the picture and look at this. This is what I'm talking about. I didn't get to show you guys exactly the differences in the last video, but this is what I'm saying. They just lie. <laughs> lie. <laughs> when your ex girlfriend says she was at work, lie. <laughs> <laughs> right here, we're gonna go outside. Well, first off, let's see if it works. Yeah, of course it didn't. Right, what, so does it come with batteries? Oh yeah, probably. You know, we just jump to conclusions. Does it come with batteries? Batteries not included. <laughs> not included. Of course not, for, for being a piece of shit. <laughs> okay, so, let's find some batteries. Alright guys, so I got the batteries right here. We have them, let's see if they actually work. So let me just, just, just give me a second here. Load, load. I have to load my weapon. <laughs> okay, batteries loaded. There we go. <laughs> let's see, will this be the first time in this series where something actually works? Well, I mean, how does it feel? I mean, it looks kind of, it looks like it'd be, oh. It feels like I'm holding the top half of the spoon. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> this needs a spoon in at the end of it. With anything, if you hit someone hard enough, it hurt, but that just, you know. That's I it. feel like I hit them my shoe harder than this thing, but we'll find out. So let's see if it works. Okay, yeah, it's not working. Yeah. It's not working. I hate this. <laughs> so, another item that I purchased and wasted money on that doesn't work. So, um, the flashlight does not work. It, I, I put the batteries in in every way possible. It does not work. So, let's go outside and do some testing with this piece of crap. Okay, guys. So, you know, it may look bad, but maybe pretty solid, though, to be honest. So, maybe it could actually work as a good bat. It's not as, like I said, I was expecting like, a full-length bat with a flashlight, not this little Dodger bat, but, you know, it'll work. So, let's see. We're going to do a test real quick. See if it'll even be able to stand. My curiosity is, is a flashlight gonna break? Cause that's like a little piece of glass. Oh yeah, it's How pretty cheap too. How much is a weapon and also a flashlight? Would you give me this little piece crappy glass? All right, my goal here is I'm gonna hit the middle one and this one's gonna fall directly onto the bottom one. Okay, that's not gonna happen. It's gonna happen, ready? Nope. I don't know why I'm nervous. <laughs> Three, two, one. Oh, it didn't even bust it. It didn't even bust it. Okay, guys, we've done that test with like everything ever and it bust. <laughs> you made it. Sick. Dude! What the heck? <laughs> the flashlight turned off! Okay, maybe what happened was like, I tried to use it as a weapon. It was like, you know what? That's not my, that's not my purpose. <laughs> yeah, my purpose is a flashlight. <laughs> it was like, you know what? I can't be good for this guy as a weapon. So let me at least be a flashlight. <laughs> 
I've never ever seen regret in an item. <laughs> now that it's a flashlight out, let's see if this can actually break it now. Maybe with the flashlight it'll work. Oh my god. That was so <laughs> anti that was so anticlimactic. This is so bad! I don't think I've ever met gotten anything that couldn't pass this test. It's a, it's a soda can. It's a so it's a shaken up soda can. Wait, wait, did you just turn on the light to make it more powerful? <laughs> right here, just a little thing, right here. God. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't oh, break it, it. It's peeing on my wall. That's what it's doing, and then nothing else. Oh my god, <laughs> that was your foot. Told you my shoe was stronger than this thing. Okay, something's happening. <laughs> you see this? Um, did it go into seizure mode? That's what I was just about to say. This is probably as dangerous as it's ever gonna get. Boom, seizure. <laughs> oh, oh. That's the only way you can't use it to hit nobody, but it can eventually break, and you can use it on epileptics exclusively. <laughs> Okay, I'm giving, we were gonna do more tests with this, I'm done, fail. All right, so I was gonna be done with this, but Parker said we should give it a benefit of the doubt because that can absorb impact a little bit, yeah. whereas this is a solid. So we'll try it out yeah, in the just, coconut. Yeah, it's back around a little bit. You it's really wanna give it the guy. hardest test of all of them? The one of the hardest ones? I gotta give it something, you just, you just gotta go all out. Just go all <laughs> out. All right, hardest hit I can, coconut test, here we go, ready? I'm ready. Three, two, one. Okay, so the next item is another sword. You just saw what happened with our last sword last time. You haven't seen it, like I said, links down below. But we're gonna do another sword because you guys wanted us to do the swords. In the next episode, I'm gonna try and do some more throwable weapons like stars, knives, stuff like that. But I wanted to do a few more swords just to see how bad they were. All right, guys, so this one, I'm already a little bit disappointed because in the picture, it looked like it was like a buster blade. Like, put a picture of a buster blade. It's like a buster blade, but it really wasn't at all. It looks like it, it's gonna be kind of small. So, as the same thing with the bat. So let's get this thing open, ready? That's a very gimmicky design, but let's see what we're working with here. Ready? Uh, oh, well. Okay. <laughs> That's what you do when you order from the worst race. Is that, yeah. is that tape? That is no duct tape, that... I'm pretty sure. That's the same thing as the other. Why is up with these bad reviews? This is just textured duct tape again. This handle is textured duct tape. And look at the side piece, they're not even sharp at all. Where's the sword? Look at the how thin that is. <laughs> This so you can cut paper like the, the the paper you can cut a sheet of paper in half yeah like but down the like, middle <laughs> down like down the middle of it yeah <laughs> okay here we go what this is the oh I didn't order God. a butter knife I ordered a sword <laughs> that was like a bread knife man <laughs> and what is this that is not do you think this is sick this gave me less sword it gave you less oh, you don't give you less sword like they, they, you're like oh look this tip is cool but you actually just missing all this material from the side. <laughs> What is this to protect me from this moderately sharp tip? Okay, so this is what we're working with right here. It just kind of looks like a giant kanai, actually. Um, let's let's go test it out. Let's see if it's throwable. Let's see if it's let's see if, it, if, it used, <laughs> if it's anything. If it can be used to do anything. All right, here we go. First test gun. Move out. Did you hear that? I can still. I wish to smack this as a joke to move. You know, this the, sounds like it just shook its whole world. Yeah, exactly. That, that one hit, that was too much for Okay, him. so like it sounds cool, right? Like, oh, that's dope. But like, that's supposed to happen when two swords collide. Yeah, not when just one. <laughs> so just when one Here we go. Church. Service is starting. <laughs> that's a church bell. That's insane. What the, with the coconut? Okay, let's just move on to my other test. The fact that this thing just hitting the side of a coconut can make it shatter its whole existence and make it question its reality is a problem. Okay, so here is the world's flimsiest sword. Here we go. Ready? Will it cut? Do you think? You know what? I'm gonna be the optimist. It's a still a sword, right? I mean, so I think as a sword or like a, a letter opener. A <laughs> letter or if you if you slash anything hard enough with a letter opener, it'll cut. True. Here we go. Ready? Three, two, one. Oh, you're joking. I'm not kidding. You can see the slash mark. Do you see it? It literally, I hit it blade first. I think I thought maybe I hit it like this, yeah, but I you can you see the slash it. mark. Well, try it. Try it. Try it again. Are you sure? You, oh, I mean, I trust your skills and everything. <laughs> I, are you sure you hit it blade first? I'm going to try again. <laughs> <Okay>. No. <laughs> okay. Okay. I'll give it one that more. That couldn't even cut me. I'll give it one more try, but. Dude. This, I'm a little concerned. This thing is worthless. I'm a, actually, I'm a lot of concerned. Okay. No, no, if that doesn't do it. It has to stab. We'll do stab first, and then we'll do throw a yeah, it has to, one It has slice. to stab. I have to do one more Fall, slice. Yeah, yeah, just one more slice, follow through. I'm though. running. Three, two, one. 
Nobody can say I didn't try and hit it. I hit it as hard as I could. Okay, one more slow moment to make sure the blade's hitting. I can't believe this right now. I can't either. We've I... literally, guys, used sheet metal and cut this before. So the fact that we can't do with this is amazing. Oh, you finally did something. Oh my god, he's not gonna live for much longer. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Somebody rushed this man to a hospital! He's got one very small trickle of blood coming out. Someone find a band-aid! He's gonna bleed out in the next 48 hours if you don't help him! <laughs> Okay, so before the next one, Parker genuinely didn't believe I was hitting it as hard as I could. I, he thought I... You can't, like you... I don't touch it, you'll, you'll break it. Did you see that? <laughs> I'm seeing it, I wish I wasn't, but okay, try it. Okay, well now I, I didn't believe you a little bit more. <laughs> I was just like, this has to be a sword. Fantasy master. The fantasy is Man. maybe being able to cut something. I know, exactly. The <laughs> fantasy is that you actually bought a sword. <laughs> <laughs> it's absolutely worthless. All right, next test. Is, oh my god, I was just aiming down. This is how I aim my throwing knives. <laughs> I can't really. All right, aiming. All right, here we go. Ready? All right, is it throwable? What do you guys have me doing out here? What did you guys make me buy this for? All right, ready? Three, two, one. Okay, it, it was shaking a lot, but I missed. But I it mean, threw. It got in the table. Yeah, it got in the table. Okay, so we found anything it could be dangerous for. Oh, that was pretty go. sweet. That was pretty sweet. And it went in between the tables. It was pretty sick. Oh, yeah, look, it went all the way through. Okay, so we found one possible use for this. Yes. Eighth hidden gate open. <laughs> <laughs> so the wrap was coming off. So I'm just gonna rock lead this bitch to just hey, hey, open the gate. Oh, all right. You know what I wonder is what are these pads right here? Like, what did they use to make like this bump in the handle? Is it metal? That's the question. Right now in the comments, is it metal that is under here making this bump? Yes or no? Let's find out. What do you guess? Plastic? It's it's, it's not metal. It's like anything but metal. <laughs> that wood? That is a piece. That is a piece of particle board. <laughs> Oh my god. They're pieces of wood. Okay, here we go. We have as one useful function besides being a stupid piece of crap. And that is throw abilities. So here we go. Ready? I'm ready. That's a scary weapon to throw. What I'm doing is throwing a sword at a bottle, but the way it sounds, it sounds like a six car collision. Oh yeah. <laughs> Alright, ready? Go. That was pretty sweet. Full flip, but we still got it. Your boy still got it. Except for in that case. <laughs> Only way I could make things last is if I accidentally do one last video. So it turns out. It can't. Come on! Get out of here! It turns out it can't. That didn't sound good. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. Is that a spatula? <laughs> that is something that the only thing I can think about using this for is just a very badass cup. <laughs> and we're done with this one. Okay, for the last item, are you ready? Am I ready? Yeah, you're ready. Oh, I'm ready. Yeah. All right, I think so. Right? Oh, yeah, I hope you are, because you're going to need to be ready. Okay. So, guys, right now, I'm going to be, I opened it up already because I wanted it to, to, to really just suck in my purchase. <laughs> so, right here, I have the last item, and this is the most expensive, worst reviewed item I bought. This thing was a about a hundred dollars, and that is a lot for one sword. I wanted to focus on swords in this video. You guys liked the sword video last much, last time so much. We're doing some different stuff from the other one, but I spent a hundred, over a hundred dollars on this sword, but it was the worst reviewed. So this is the worst reviewed, most expensive sword. Okay, so it's the biggest piece of crap. Yeah. And the most expensive. Piece I mean, of crap. we don't know if it's a crap yet. We haven't tested it yet. True. Let's take a look at it. Let's give you a little glimpse of it. All right, ready to take a look at it? Let's I'm telling it. you, it's pretty badass looking. You know, a sword's gonna be epic when you just see that. <laughs> okay, okay, it's like a fall. Oh, oh. Ooh, oh, yes. Ooh. This is a Renaissance era sword. It's not from that era, of course, but oh. a Renaissance era sword. Are you ready? I think. <sighs> this is it right here. So, this is oh. the worst. Yeah. Ah. That's bad, uh, that's bad. That might be one of the many reasons it has bad reviews, but it's a very nice looking sword, but. Yeah. Oh, oh, dude, that made me like squirm a little It makes bit. a very high pitch sound, and I haven't even went outside with it yet. Listen to this. No way, you're <laughs> already doing that. The fact that I'm holding the blade right now. <laughs> I was about to say, it doesn't look sharp. <laughs> it's not very sharp. You know it's even less sharp? Dip. <laughs> oh my god, it's literally like a circle. But what I do know is most Renaissance era blades aren't actually that sharp. They're actually, they use their weight to be what's the cutting power. So maybe it'll turn out to be very, very good actually. I don't really know. But man, does it look sick. You know it's badass when you got a little chain like this. What does that do? Nothing. Maybe that's where you carry it somehow. No, you, the only way you can carry it is like. 
<laughs> All right, honey, have a good uh, day at the joust. <laughs> Okay, so for the Renaissance era sword, we can't just have a regular jug. So we have the big one right here. We have the five pounder right here. You guys know fans will make a dance. That one, right? That, is that part of the sword? That is part of the sword. Okay, well, this just fell off the sword. I'm like, come on! I haven't even hit anything yet. Okay, fruit test. Let's go. Let's do it. All right, use this Mel as cantaloupe actually first. Cantaloupe. cantaloupe. Right here. What is that? What's what? Is it like a melon holder? This can't. This is my cantaloupe holder. This is meant to hold my target. It's not a cantaloupe holder. <laughs> that is a cantaloupe holder. Okay, leave my cantaloupe holder. You're bowl telling bowl. me you went online and you saw and you sought out a cantaloupe holder? Yeah. <laughs> I actually no. I invented the cantaloupe holder. This item right here exclusively holds cantaloupe. <laughs> Anything else you put in there, it'll burn. Uh, what? Anything else you put in there, it'll burn. Uh, my cantaloupe. <laughs> Watch this. Ready, ready. Oh my God! It's burned water. Whoa! 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 <laughs> okay, it's, it's from another video, but <laughs> just don't worry about it. I'll put a candle open. Okay, okay, come on in here. Right here. Go on, get ready. Come on, here we go. Right, well, now watch yourself, you're killed now. <laughs> this looks like an albino breast. <laughs> oh my god. Here we go. Gonna give this man a little haircut right off the top. Ready? Let's we'll do it. Right off the top. Right off the top. <laughs> right off the top. <laughs> <laughs> Right off the top! Ooh. And that's how you find a nucleus, kid. <laughs> <laughs> oh! 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 Who wants the slice? Because my papa made plenty. And it tastes like shit. <laughs> I want to eat everything that comes off the ground. That's where I started. <laughs> <laughs> Pineapple Express again! <laughs> Nice. You know what, dude? I'm not gonna lie, it's not sharp whatsoever, but... <laughs> hands bleed. <laughs> <laughs> Bl hands are just covered in blood. <laughs> it's, maybe a little bit, but it's not sharp really, guys. But, like I said, the kinetic energy, because it's so heavy, you're allowed to get way more force. I'm almost gonna say pass. You know, <laughs> you know I'm not, I don't blame you for that. I mean, yeah, I mean, that's actually metal. That's like not, that's not yeah, bad. That's and not it's cheap. falling apart, and I mean, it's, it's not sharp. It's cheap, but it's like expensive cheap. Yeah, and it's freaking able to cut through some stuff. Okay, so I'm gonna try. Try. Right, Here we go. Let's do it. I'm gonna slay this dragon one blood vessel at a time. Damn, that's a lot of blood vessels. Yes! A lot of blood vessels! Ah! Oh! It didn't go through. Maybe I could make it. No, I can't. That's about it. <laughs> that's a deep little go. You know what? That's pretty impressive. That was pretty badass, too. This, this sword, like, it just looks like you're hacking off limbs. Oh, like, yeah. the weight of it. Oh, there we go. Yeah, it's no, exactly. <laughs> a slice though. Will it be able to do a slice? That's that's the real question. So for the stab test, it's kind of a pass slash. Uh, it went fast. <laughs> but will it slice? No. I don't know how you managed to do this one though. What, what was that, Parker? I call him a jerk. Uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I've never read a book. But to be 100% honest, there's so much weight. I feel like if you did slash somebody, you'd break their collarbone. Oh, yeah. For no, sure. It would hurt. It would hurt a lot. You wouldn't go through that. Yeah, there's a lot of weight to make it worth the pain, but not a very good weapon. All right, next test. Let's do it. Ready? Put this on the melon, the melon holder. <laughs> Man, it worked. <laughs> and then next, my manhood. <laughs> I just bought it because it looked funny. I don't want to. I don't. Yeah. I, I get that away from me, man. It's going right back where it came from. <laughs> Let's do it. Let's do it. Oh! Oh, you did it. Yeah, dude. That is almost more effortless than the katana. Okay. I, come I'm not on. kidding you. I'm not kidding. Like, the weight is so heavy. It's almost like an axe or like a sledgehammer mixed with a sword. Because it's so heavy, I, I it just cuts I, I just it. don't believe you on that. Watch. I'm going to do like the most minimal hit. I guarantee it does the whole thing. I'm like going to put like 20% strength. Okay, it didn't go through. No, but I like pretty much by a sliver. <laughs> by a sliver, it didn't go through. That's what I'm saying. It's like got so much weight, you really can just go through stuff. All right. <laughs> All right, guys, so that is actually it for this video. I'm gonna go ahead and give this one a pass. Yeah, I, I can agree with that. Yeah, definitely not worth the money. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Yeah, but I will give it a pass as a usable weapon because it does have a lot of energy, but definitely not worth the money. So, if you guys want to see another one of these videos, make sure to smash the like button. I mean, smash. I mean, smash was literally broken. I mean, what I just always do it in every video. Turn on post notifications. I'll see you beautiful in the next video. Adios! <laughs>